under 1.6, develop ultimate patient fluency. I can set up and sell multi-step problems with at least two steps. Step it out. Number one, fund park amusement rents two cart team booths, equipment and rides for parties, fundraisers, and county fair. The rental prices are shown in the table. In May, 36 team booths and 14 rides are rented from fun park. How much did the fun park earn from the team booths and ride rentals in May? So, what numbers are we using? 36 and 14 rides, and then we should have said booths, right? 36 team booths. And then, let's put them all together. 36 team booths, and then we're looking for how much did they earn, okay? From that. So, what do we need to find? What did we just say we needed to find? Okay, so. How much did they earn from 36 Right, the multiplication equation to find to model each cost, so we're going to do what? 36. 36 times what? 79 equals, okay, and then we're also going to do what? Okay, we're going to work it out down here in the space. So 36 times 79, 9 times 6 is? Put the four, carry the five. Nine times three is plus five is thirty-two. Okay, mark off the five, mark off the nine, put a zero because we're moving to the tenth spot. Seven times six is carry the four. Seven times three is plus four is add it. Four, four, eight. Two, so two thousand eight hundred forty-four dollars, right? Okay. The next one is what? Okay, but what should I put on top? One hundred forty-nine times fourteen. So four times nine is, but a six carry a three. Four times four is plus three is carry the one. Four times one is plus one is. Mark up the one, mark up the three, mark up the four, and put a zero because we're moving to the ten spot. One times nine is one times four is one times one is Adam six eighteen one ten carry the one two. Now what do I do? So six plus four is. Carry the one, one plus four plus eight is, carry the one, one plus eight is, and then two plus two is. So, how much did they make? Okay, and then it's the point on your answer. Basically, your word is how we got it, right? Okay. Step it out. Number two, new floor tiles are being installed in a restaurant at an amusement park. There are 254 tiles needed to cover the floor. What is the area of the floor? So we need to do 254, right? What is the area of the floor? So how can you use the measurements of a floor tile to find the area of the restaurant floor? So what are we going to do? Right. So you're going to find the area of the floor tile first, which is 24 times. 18, 18 and then take that times what? Why did I put parentheses around that? So that that would be done first, okay? So it says right here to find the area of the floor tile, 24 times 18. 8 times 4 is, carry the 3. 8 times 2 is, plus 3 is, mark off the 3, mark off the 8, and put a 1 times 4 is, 1 times 2 is, then add it, 2, 13, carry the 1, 4. So 432 squared. Okay.
Okay, now that we know the area of the floor tile, we need to take the 432 times. Four times two is four times three is twelve. Carry the one. Four times four is plus one is mark off the one, mark off the four, and put a zero because we're moving to the spot, right? Five times two is ten. the one. Five times three is plus one is carry the one. Five times four is plus one is and I have to make sure I'm keeping everything in line, right, guys? Yeah. If I don't, am I going to get off and get the wrong answer? Yes. yes. So mark off the one, mark off the one, mark off the five. And now I put two zeros so I can move to the hundred spot. Two times two is four. Two times three is two times four is And then add. So eight. Two, seven plus six is, plus four is, carry the one. One plus one plus one plus six is nine. Two plus eight is ten. Go back three from the right. Or I'm going to go to the left, right? Correct? Yeah. Sorry, using all those things. Okay, so um, what is the area of the restaurant? Or we could do square inches, right? You can write it either way, okay? Check understanding. Number one, this year the company spends $660 to train one new employee. In 10 years, training costs will be twice that amount. The company expects to hire 635 new employees in the 10th year. How much will the company spend for training? So right now, they're doing 660, right? Okay, in 10 years, it's going to be what? Twice that amount of the 660, right? And then they expect to hire 635 new employees. So how much will the company spend for training? So what do I need to do first? $660 times 50. Okay, so 660 times two, and then I said we need to do that first, so I need to do what? Parentheses times what? Times 635 equals. So we're gonna go over here to the side and work that out. So we're gonna do, we said 60 times two first. Two times zero is? Oh, zero, yeah. Okay, two times six is 12, carry the one. Two times six is? 12, 12 plus 1 is 15. Okay. Now we need to take that. I'm actually going to move that or rewrite that. Because sometimes if we try and use that, is it going to get a little crowded? Yes. Okay, so 1,320 times what now? 635. 5 times 0 is 0. 5 times 2 is? Carry the 1. 5 times 3 is? Plus one is, carry the one. Five times one is, plus one is, mark off the one, mark off the five, and put a zero. Three times zero is zero. Three times two is six. Three times three is nine. Three times one is three. Do I have to regroup? Nope. So just mark off the three, put two zeros, because now I'm moving to the hundred spot. Six times zero is six times two is carry the one. Six times three is plus one is carry the one. Six times one is plus one is and then what? Add zero zero six plus six is carry the one. Six plus six is seven plus nine is sixteen. Okay. Plus two is, put the eight, carry the one. One plus three plus nine is, carry the one and eight. So they would have to spend $838,200. Use the table showing fun price amusement rental prices for two and three. How much more is the cost of 18 
rides, those are what you rent. 26 free games. So 18 rides, 26 free games. Okay, and then they want to know how much more. So what do we need to do first? So 149 times 18. 8 times 9 is? I get the 7. 8 times 4 is? Plus 7 is? Carry the 3. 8 times 1 is? Plus 3 is? Mark off the 3. Mark off the 7. Mark off the 8. And put a 1 times 9 is? 1 times 4 is? 1 times 1 is? And then add it. So 2. 18, carry the one, six, two. Okay, now what do we do? Okay, nine times six is? Or carry the five, nine times two is? Plus five is? Mark off the five, mark off the nine, put a zero. Seven times six is? Carry the four. Seven times four, or two is? Fourteen. Plus four is? Eighteen. Add four, five, ten, one, two. So now what do I do? Add them. Add them. Subtract. Subtract 2,682 minus 2,054. So this becomes a 12. This becomes a 7, right? 12 minus 4 is? Eight. 7 minus 5 is 2. 6 minus 0 is? Oh, so the difference is? Okay, number 3. So this one went with number 2. Okay, number 3. What is the cost to have 39 food carts and 78 food games? So 39 food carts, 78 food games, and then the cost to rent them. So, what am I going to do? Oh, um, 39 so, times 59. So 39 times 59. Okay, 9 times 9 is? Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to carry the 8. 9 times 3 is? Mm -hmm. Plus 8 is? Mm -hmm. 35. Mark off the 8. Mark off the 9. Put a 0. 5 times 9 is? Put the 5, carry the 4. Three, or 5 times 3 is? Plus 4 is? Add it together. 1, 10, carry the 1. 13, carry the 1, 2, right? All right, what did you get? 39 times 59. 9 times 8 is? You carry the seven, right? Nine times seven is plus seven is. Mark off the seven, mark off the nine, put a zero. Seven times eight is. Put the six, carry the five. Seven times seven is plus five is. And add it. Two, six, eleven, right? Six. Now what do I do? Add them together, right? Six, one, six, two, uh, two, three, zero, one. Two plus one is? Six plus zero is? One plus three is? Six plus two is? So they spend 8,460. 